Hey y'all, and welcome to Keeping Up with Christy. As you can see, Christy's not here. She's actually let me do one on my own. So I'm making my solo debut today, and I'm gonna show you how to make Taco Bell Cinnamon Twist. This is our homemade hack on those. All right, so we got us um, some oil going here in the pan, got it going hot, and we're gonna see if it's ready. So, and so here's a trick that we do. We take a wooden spoon and put it in there. If it starts to bubble, it is ready to go. So our, our oil is ready to roll. So you, might, then, you might want to turn it down just a little bit. All right, we're gonna turn it down a little bit. I think it's a little bit too hot. I can smell it. I can smell it burning too. It's getting too hot. All right, and so we have some um, Chichi Rons here that I got at the Mexican um, supermarket here local in town. And they're actually um, like whole wheat noodles. And so what happens is you take these that are spiral, make sure you get spiral. You just take a couple and you drop them in the oil. And then they should puff up just like cinnamon twists from Taco Bell. Turn your oil back up. Turn my oil back up. Turn it down too low. Here they go. And there they are. So you let those go for just a few minutes or a few seconds. I think that's long enough, don't you? Take them out. Put them onto my plate with some paper towels. Like so. And then we'll do a few more. And then we'll put them into a cinnamon and sugar bag and shake them up a little bit. I'll throw a good bit of them so it'll take forever. How'd you learn how to do this? I learned how to do this um, on TikTok. Because, <laughs> you know, I'm hip and cool like the young kids these days. Oh, my Lord. Being on TikTok. So I saw this on TikTok. My oil is too hot. I think I put too many in there. <laughs> no, they're not done. They're not done? All right. Give them a little more of a stir here. Okay. I think they're good. Put them on my plate over here. Yeah, I learned how to do this on TikTok and I didn't know if it would work. But one thing I do need to tell you, make sure that you don't go and buy regular pasta at the store. It will not work. It has to be this type of um, chicharron from like a, I got mine from the uh, Capare Foods. I don't know what you have local in your area, but um, just go in and ask them for whole wheat chicharrons and they'll know exactly what you're talking about. Now I'm gonna take my oil, take it off the heat. We'll make some more later, but I wanna show you what we do here. I have just a Ziploc bag full of um, sugar and cinnamon. I did a quarter cup of sugar and a tablespoon, uh, no, a teaspoon of cinnamon. So I did a quarter cup of sugar and I did a full teaspoon of cinnamon. All right, and then you just, oh, these gonna be hot. Just take them and drop them in here. I don't know how many to put in here at a time. Handful or so. And then give them a shake. And then put them in our pretty little bowl over here, like so. And we have cinnamon twist from Taco Bell. Good job. Made at home. Here, let me take a bite. Okay. Pretty dang close. It's yeah. Really, really good. Okay, guys, we got everything um, seasoned up with the cinnamon and the uh, sugar, and now we got a uh, nice big bowl full of them. And I just want to tell you thank you for watching. And uh, thank you, Christy, for letting me do this by myself. Yeah, so I, it was really fun. I had a good time doing it. Um, I do want to give you one last little tip that we found out. If you have this in the refrigerator, some whipped cream spray, make sure that you use it and put a little dollop down the side of it. It makes it wonderful. All right. Hey, make sure that you go and you like this. And also, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. Thank you. Bye, y'all.
do I say to start? <laughs> How about you say hi? <laughs> Hang on, start over. Go ahead. I'm nervous. Oh my gosh. Nah. Pretty dang close. It's yeah. Really, really good. <coughs> Cinnamon will get you. Cinnamon will get you. Take that out. Uh huh. We gotta fill it. Now. I'm done.